So, uh, hey guys, uh, set up the uh, SDR Play um, and RSPST network SDR. So inside it has a Raspberry Pi. Actually, my um, my security on my router told me that a Raspberry, Raspberry Pi device was to be connected. So it tells you that it's a Raspberry Pi used in here with, of course, the SDR software. Right now, it's uh, connected through Wi-Fi. The little antenna here is Wi-Fi. And, of course, um, it's going wirelessly through my router. And on the screen over there, it is connected. And you see a... Uh, we're listening to a signal 9650 here, which I don't know exactly what it is, but this is the... Uh, and RSPST, it says it right here on the upper left. Connected through Wi-Fi, through my own network. And uh, immediately SDR connect, recognize, it searched for a device and it found that this network device was there. Um, setup was like not a hundred percent easy. I had to restart the setup uh, a couple of times, uh, including my Wi-Fi connection that seemed to not want to be recognized anymore. I had to remove it and restart and reconnect with the uh, the software, the administrative software that that's uh, with the uh, device with SDR Connect. Uh, but for the most part. Once it uh, once it was detected, worked fine. So uh, continue to play with this. We'll be making more videos um, in the next uh, days, and of course, full review. I'll be testing it in different types of uh, environment, including VHF, UHF. But for now, it really seems to uh, work like a. Uh, standard RSP device that you'd connect even though now it's wireless on my side rather than being connected via USB cable so it's kind of cool kind of cool to see that it works so the uh, device is the airplay and RSP SD so more videos to come as I'll be testing it more but uh, kind of cool a little device.